Stand by to lose. G'day guys, welcome back to another episode. Today, we're going snapper fishing, bean snapper fishing. I'm gonna give you a few tips on how to catch snapper. One of the easiest fish to, to catch. Uh, tried and true method. I'm gonna start off with uh, what rig and rod and reel we're gonna use. So, I only need a little, got a little 5,000 stratic. Don't need a big heavy reel. Pretty affordable. Um, spooled up with 20 pound braid on there and then 40 pound leader off to a little snelled rig and uh, use 5 -0, 6 -0 sort of style hooks with the little flashes um, and add on if you want just up to a swivel so the rod rod we're using it's a this is an actually insult non-stop fillet snapper slayer rod designed for snapper fishing nice soft tip so you get a good cast nice strength in the butt so when you're fighting it fighting the fish and get it up it's a great length to work around the boat when you get the snapper it's a pe one to 1.5 to 2.5 so really light easy to use got 10 kilo snapper on these no worries at all so we'll head out there and uh we'll show you a few more tricks so hopefully you learn something today and see how we catch snapper thanks well <laughs> Uh, who loves getting up early on a Sunday morning and flicking the TV on and seeing what's up, what's happening in the world? A couple of little ones. <laughs> <laughs> Straight in the wind, yep. 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 It's uh, 11 meters, bro, 11 meters. Ooh, anchor's grabbing. Oh, look at that. If we don't get snapped, mate, we're gonna get shot. <laughs> Dirtiest mix. What do you got in there, Joanna? Oh, everything. Skippy. <laughs> bit of blue. A bit of a clean out. A bit of a freezer clean out. <laughs> <laughs> That'll bring him in. Look, it's oiling up slick already. Right. Woohoo! Snap a maraca. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hope that lid's on properly. <laughs> 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 So we're just on the James service, uh, anchored up in about 10 metres, no particular spot, found a lump, went in front, dropped it on the sand, throw the burly out, and yeah, we'll get some, float some muleys out the back. Pretty standard snapper procedure there. And sit and wait. So, um, let's see how we go. Another with, uh... <laughs> oh, the dogs will eat it later. <laughs> Got out a bit late, but I reckon. Bit of a late, a late my, start. My, um, I like to get the burly out. Up. But how good is that? Sun's coming up. Dino's got the breakfast of champions. <laughs> just getting the pre the, the pre workout in there. <laughs> and now we just wait. So we've got our muley on here. A little scoot, tracked them, snelled two hooks, beautifully like that. Snap is going to come up, bite that, and we're going to catch it. <laughs> but all you want to do, we've got our burly out, our anchor, everything's running out. We're just going to flick it out, not too far, let some line out for a bit. It's just going to float out there in our burly trail. Got all our, we've got crabs, crays, pellets, bits of fish guts all floating out there. Snapper are going to come in and they're going to grab our bait on the way through. Our drag, it's not too tight. Just once you get them off the bottom, they have good fun out of a couple of runs. Land the fish, it's pretty simple. Just let that float out. Keep checking it every 10 or 20 minutes. That's it. Beautiful. Just sit back and enjoy. 
Hey, snapper, snapper, snapper. Ooh, ooh. It's been a minute. Snapperish. Big shakes there, boy. Yes. A little straight. Finally hooked one. Yeah, it's been a few. Oh, maybe an hour and a half. Coming oh. up the back of there. Nets over there, bro. It's off the bottom. Shouldn't have much to go. Hold on, where's it? I've got it. Dirty water. Oh. He's angry, eh? He's not done, eh? Keep <laughs> that up in the net. Yes! In the net. Woo hoo hoo! <laughs> <laughs> Good luck, boys. Oh, it's all right. Sweet. Oh, he's in the corner of the jaw. Look at that. Lovely snap. Perfect. Yeah, mate. Might have just come on, so nice. Uh, just being patient. We we're talking about do we move, do we not? But we've been burling up for a while, so where there's one, there's usually more. It's a beautiful snapper. Hold it up for the viewers, mate. Jesus. Oh yeah, for us here this size. Sometimes they go harder than the bigger ones, you know? Yeah, they do. Look at that. This is how the whole scoots. It's right in there, look, see? We'll have to take him home. Get yeah, out. Yeah, that's right, the gills, mate. That was, we'll leave, I reckon release this one straight into the esky on ice. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> Fresh nap for breakfast. On the mat here, he's gonna go. Oh, he's right on the 700 ish. Yeah, we'll call him, we'll call him 700. Beautiful morning, snapper. Snapper's Ew. pack. No, they're not packed, we only got one. We got one <laughs> half packed, half packed, <laughs> six pack. Yeah, it's just patience, patience, patience. It's no real, um, no real mark here, it's just. Trying to find some sand in between some ledges and burly up. But yeah, you don't have to go far out, as you can see. <laughs> I'll give away my spot. There's the James Service marker. We're about 500 meters from that. Don't tell no one. <laughs> So guys, thanks for watching the video. Hopefully you learn how to catch a snapper. This uh, this one here, the one we caught today, we're gonna actually donate this skeleton to fisheries. So I'll knock the fillets off it, give them um, the time, the date, every all the other information for research. It's a good cause, guys. Uh, they're always after skeletons. Uh, I'll leave some links in the video description. Boots. Cheers, guys.